Hi, I'm Martin Williamson, Head of Residential Property at Latimer Hink Solicitors in Darlington and you join us for the first uh, Property Shops video of 2022. 2021 was a strange year and uh, the property market defied all predictions. So I've come to Yarm this morning to talk to local agent John Newhouse uh, to see what he thinks are the prospects for 2022 and how the year started. So John, thanks for joining us on uh, Property Shots today. Pleasure. Now you've brought us to High Church Wind in Yarm, which is just a stone's throw literally from the, the high street in Yarm. Yep. Um, a collection of old quaint cottages, um, very peaceful, just a stone's throw, as I say, from the high street. Is this typical of Yarm? Yes, yeah, it's typical of the central part of Yarm. So you've got uh, West, West Street at this end linking to the High Street. So these, pop these properties are very popular with those wishing, I guess, central living access to the High Street. Uh, so easy shopping access and so on. But uh, typical of the centre of Yarm. And then Yarm sort of explodes yeah. out to uh, Yarm on the south side of the river. And then across to the north side of the river, you've got Eaglescliff. Uh, you've got a selection of first-time buyer properties and family homes. Uh, here you've got uh, excellent schooling, both public and private, uh, uh, both in Yarm and Eaglescliff. So it's always been a popular area from mm -hmm. a family perspective. Mm -hmm. Yarm is, is you know, one of the best high streets locally. It's also quite a vibrant uh, nightlife uh, high street. So the first time buyer market is, is generally pretty popular True. here for that. Yeah. So you've, you have got a very popular area, transport links. It yeah. is a place that people would want to live, sure. uh, but certainly post-pandemic is yeah. it's increased that idea. Yeah. Um, prices ranging really from about 130,000 first time buyer market through to the, the millions mm. uh, in this sort of top end of course, of you've, you've got offices around the area, haven't you? Over yep. in Stokesley and Ingleby Barwick, yep. very different areas yep. covering a wide range of properties. How have you found the strange boom that we had last year? And what do you think is likely to happen this coming year, 2022? Yeah, so Yarm uh, certainly enjoyed uh, a boom, a boom in, in, in activity 2020 mm. post lockdown to now. This year really has started off in very similar vein to, yeah. to the end of last year, which is predominantly a lack of property stock on the market, well, yeah, high yeah. demand. Uh, and for each property coming on, there is significant demand. Mm. The, average, um, the average price we achieved last year was 105% of the price. So demand is still really yeah. outstripping supply. Yeah, well, I think it's very definitely a case every year of new year, new broom. Yeah. Um, and uh, I, my own view is that there's no reason to think that the buoyancy of the market from last year is not going to carry forward into this year. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I mean, we're you know, starting to see interest rates rising, perhaps, yeah. but, you know, our markets have been buoyant in much different interest think, rate yeah, environments right. to, yeah. to now, so they're yeah. still low. So, yeah, I would expect that we will see a, a, a buoyant market and, you know, the properties are sort of hard to find. So, uh, yeah, my advice to buyers would be looking at the current time would be be prepared, have your solicitors ready in advance, have your mortgage, if you're taking one, ready in advance when the property comes along the more advanced you are to mm. make that offer, well, that's the better chance very, you've very got of good, getting it. Very good advice, and mm. I, hope, I hope that's heeded. Well, thank you, John, uh, and thank you for joining us on another of our Latimer Hinks Property Shots videos. Uh, join us next time when we'll be looking at the property market in another part of our region uh, as the spring comes nearer, and as I say, people dust themselves down and brush up their properties and hopefully put them on the market.